Here's how any lawyer can get more clients for less money. That's the dream, right? Make more, spend less. I'm gonna tell you how our clients do it and how you can do it as well in this video. Now, one thing that you have to understand is that the most successful companies in the world, whether it's Nike, whether it's Pepsi, whether it's Coca-Cola, whether it's other law firms like Morgan & Morgan and Farrah and & Farrah and these giant firms, they all got there the same way. And that is by running ads. It's all through advertising. Now, I talk to lawyers all the time who don't want to even spend money on ads. Now. There's only one reason and one reason only why you wouldn't spend money on ads, and that's because you don't think that it's going to work. If I said, give me $100 and I'm gonna give you $500 back, everybody would take that deal. And if you know how to use advertising correctly, you'll end up paying less per client and you end up making deals like that where you give Google $100 and they give you back $500, $1,000, $1,500. But you have to do it the right way and I'm gonna show you in this video how to do it the right way so that you can get high quality cases for not much money. The first thing that you have to understand is three little letters and that is CRO, conversion rate optimization. Now, across the legal industry, when it comes to Google ads, the average conversion rate is 6.98% according to WordStream. And what that means is that if you get 100 people to click on your ads, seven approximately will call you. Now on our landing pages that we create for our clients, we have managed to get this up to 15%, which means that when 100 people click on the ad, 15 call, which is eight more than the industry average. Now this is significant because the more phone calls you get, the more cases you're gonna sign up. So let's take the keyword personal injury lawyer near me. Now, if you were to bid on this keyword, it's gonna cost you approximately $36.73 per click. That means that every single time somebody clicks on that ad, you're gonna get charged $36.73. So if you get 100 clicks, that's gonna cost you $3,673. Now, if your ads perform at the industry standard of 6.98%, that's gonna give you seven phone calls for 100 clicks, which is gonna cost you $525 per phone call. Now, if you implement the optimization tactics that I'm about to share with you, the same ones that we use, then there's a very good chance that you're gonna get about a 15% or even greater conversion rate on your ads. Now, that means that when 100 people click on your ads, it's still gonna cost you $3,673, but now you've got 15 phone calls instead of seven. And that means that you're spending $244 per phone call instead of $525. Now, that's a significant savings per phone call, but it also means that you're getting more leads, which means that you're more likely to get more cases. Now, our team has managed over $100 million in ad spend for lawyers, and there's four things that we found that significantly impact the conversion rate, which takes it from that 6.98% to 15% and above. Now, the first thing is a dedicated landing page. There's so many times when lawyers run PPC ads and it takes them right to your website or it takes right to your homepage. This is not good because when they go to your website, the website has all kinds of information on it that is not designed to capture their information or to get somebody to pick up the phone and call you. You gotta remember your website has all kinds of links and navigation and all kinds of stuff. When you use a dedicated landing page whose sole purpose is to capture the contact information of the visitor or get that person to pick up the phone and call you, your conversion rate goes through the roof significantly. So if you're running Google ads and they're landing on your website or they're landing on your homepage, that's not good. You've got to get rid of that. The other thing is that your website should be optimized for both conversion rate optimization and search engine optimization. But the problem is most marketing companies don't understand how to optimize properly for conversion rate optimization. So you get a little bit of search engine optimization and zero conversion rate optimization. Conversion rate optimization is the bread and butter that makes this whole thing work. Conversion rate optimization means how do we optimize the rate at which somebody converts? How do we optimize optimize the rate at which somebody is inspired to pick up the phone and call you and book an appointment or fill out the contact form and book an appointment. That is what needs to be focused on. And if someone's going to your website, that's not going to happen because if they've done their job, the page should be optimized for both SEO and conversion rate optimization. Now, odds are they haven't done their job and they've done a crappy job on the SEO and they haven't done any conversion rate optimization 
if your law firm is pretty much like every law firm out there that I've seen with the exception of a few. So what you need is a dedicated landing page that doesn't care about search engine optimization because of the fact that you're paying for the lead to get there, so it doesn't matter, and is finely tuned for conversion rate optimization. What is the number one piece of conversion rate optimization that you can put on a page that will get somebody to pick up the phone and call you? Well, that's our second thing. That's our second most impactful thing that we found. And that is to make sure that the ad matches the message on the page. What does that mean? You need a dedicated landing page for every type of ad that you're gonna run and every type of case that you wanna get. So let's say you're a personal injury attorney. If you're a personal injury attorney, odds are you want car accident cases, you want truck accident cases, you want motorcycle accident cases, you want slip and fall cases, you want nursing home abuse cases, and probably a lot of other cases as well. Now, when somebody clicks on your ad, let's say they click on a car accident ad, they search car accident lawyer and they click on your car accident ad. That landing page better be about car accidents because if it's just about general personal injury, that is not congruent with what they clicked on. For best results, for optimal results, if they click on a car accident ad, that will take them to a car accident landing page. Having this congruency where the message on the ad matches the message on the landing page is the number one thing that you can do to increase conversion rates. If they click car accident and it takes them to a general personal injury page, that's not good. And this applies to every single practice area without exception. Now, the third most impactful way and the second thing we do for conversion rate optimization is we sell the resort, not the plane ride. What does that mean? Everybody wants the result of your legal services. Nobody wants your actual legal service. For example, if you're a divorce lawyer, nobody wants a divorce. What they want is they want the result that a divorce gives them. They want freedom from their spouse. They wanna find their soulmate. They wanna have a relationship with their kids. They wanna get out of a abusive relationship, but they don't want the divorce. The number one thing that divorce clients say to their attorneys is I just want this to be over, right? They're not like, oh man, I love this divorce process. This divorce process is awesome. Can I do another divorce? That would be great. No, they don't want that. So stop selling that. Start selling the outcome. Now, why I call this the airplane test is because think about when you go on vacation. When you go on vacation, you think about the sandy beaches. You think about, let's say you're going to an all-inclusive resort. You think about you know, the unlimited food. You think about the drinks. You think about the dancing. You think about all the great stuff that's at the resort. Nobody's thinking, man, I can't wait to go through TSA and get crammed into a metal tube to fly 500 miles an hour, two miles above the earth, have to go through customs and have to deal with finding my bags. and have to, like Nobody wants that stuff. They don't want that. That is the vehicle that takes them to the resort. You have to ask yourself in all your messaging, am I selling the resort or am I selling the airplane ride? Now, there's only three things that you really should be talking about on your landing page. The first thing is what is it that they want? And what they want is not your legal services. What is the outcome that they want? What is the result that they want? The second thing you should be talking about is how do they get it? How do they get this thing that they want? And then the third and final thing that you should be talking about is what will their life be like after they get it? Now, if you put all this information on your landing page, that will significantly increase your conversion rates because you're talking about what somebody actually wants. You're giving them what they actually want. There's a saying in marketing, sell them what they want and then give them what they need, right? So they don't want a divorce. They want freedom from their spouse. They don't want a bankruptcy. They want financial freedom, right? But your service, your legal service is the vehicle that takes them to the destination. And you have to understand the difference because understanding the difference is the difference between a 15% conversion rate and a 6.98% conversion rate. And then finally, the last thing that we add is social proof. We overwhelm with social proof. We use Google reviews. We use a plugin called ElfSite for Google reviews. We add video testimonials, video reviews to the page. We do written testimonials because some people like like to watch videos and some people like to read. We don't wanna just guess at who's on the page, we wanna give options. We wanna make sure that we have written testimonials and that we have video testimonials on the page. Now, if you follow all of this advice, the result will be more clients for less money, which means that you as a law firm owner will make more money. So I hope you got a lot of value out of this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I'll see you on the next video.